Well, if you were watching KXHD News at 6 earlier today, you may remember we told you the story of 9-year-old Amber Hagerman. She's the young girl involved in that unsolved Arlington murder that led to the Amber Alert system. That's right. The automatic alert has saved hundreds of children, and now children in our area are using their creativity to ensure Amber's death is never forgotten. KXHD News reporter Shaden Nazanpour has more. All over the Brazos Valley took time to draw pictures with the words, Bring Our Missing Children Home. The artwork is a part of the 6th Annual Regional Poster Contest held by the Amber Alert Network. The winner of the state contest uh, from the state of Texas will be sent to the national contest, which will the winner will be announced on May 25th in Washington, D.C., and uh, May 25th is National Missing Children's Day. Last year's state winner came from Brian's Crockett Elementary, but the contest is more than art on paper. The 72 participants also learn what to look for in those stranger danger situations. Part of the curriculum that goes along with the National Missing Children's Day poster contest is not only to have kids creatively uh, execute the theme uh, of the Missing Children's Poster Contest, but also to use the curriculum to raise awareness that, hey, this does happen uh, in every community. Police in our area utilize this event to also spread awareness. You don't want to scare them unnecessarily, but they are old enough to where you can start having that conversation about safety. Uh, so that they can start learning that, uh, you know, that there are some dangers out there. Dangers that can be prevented with the help of open and honest conversation between a child and parent. In College Station, Shaden Nazifor, KX HD News. This year's winner once again comes from Crockett Elementary, but his or her name has not yet been released. Yeah, that child will now compete at the national level.